Hi Cancer, welcome to your mid-monthly reading. I am Charlene Lizette. If you are new here, how's it going? Welcome, thanks so much for stopping by. I hope you click subscribe. If you're returning a massive thank you too. All right Cancer, I am recording this on the phone. <laughs> what the hell was that? No, I'm not taking this as a reading, but what the hell was that? That was crazy. Okay, so I'm recording this on the full moon in Cancer. Uh, what else do we have going on? We have Mercury retrograde. We have Venus retrograde. Don't take back X's. Be careful in signing contracts. Um, don't make any major changes to your hair, your face, all that kind of stuff. Okay? Mom, look what happened to my Roblox. Yeah, because you used all your time. No, I didn't. I didn't like play. Sorry, guys. Okay, you can do something else. Thank you. Okay. Thanks. All right, so Cancer, let's see what's going on for you this uh, mid-month. Sorry, my son is home because it's a snow day here today. And uh, yeah, so let's see what's going on. Okay, so we got the Page of Swords, the Four of Wands, the Ace of Swords. Okay. Five of Swords, lots of air energy, and the Five of Pentacles, and the Hanged Man, Piscean energy at the bottom here, introspective self-reflection, the Five of Wands, wow, fighting some inner demons, holy cow, Whew. this feels uh, intense, guys, what is happening with your cards? Oh my God, I, you know what? Look at this, the full moon today. I'm recording this on your full moon today. Yeah, what did I say? Fighting your inner demons, you got opposition. Okay, so maybe what we need to do, let's get one more card out here and then I will, uh, I'll do a little mantra with you, okay? Because, Y'all need a breather. Are you like running high on emotion? Your feelings must be all over the place. Holy cow, man. Peace. Of course. I'm a being a love and I release all negative energy. Of course you would get this. Okay. So we're going to say that because I think you need to. There's a lot of like, I feel it. Like it feels like stagnant, stuck energy, angry energy, like villainesque, mad, de like inner demons, frustration, like rage like a like a crab gone mad okay let's do this already okay peace i am a being of love and i release all negative energy let's do that again i am a being of love and i release all negative energy so maybe as you're watching this video or throughout the day if this mantra is resonating with you just say it over and over again i am a being of love and i release all negative energy peace Okay, so you got the full moon, um, energy peak, harvest blessings, achievement, and opposition, uh, uh, complement, duality, dependence, differentiation, oscillation, objectivity, interaction. So what I am seeing based off of this is that this full moon, while it's offering you some blessings here, especially with the page of swords and the four of wands, it's also illuminating and showing you maybe um, some toxicity. Like it's interesting because there's five cards. The middle card is the Ace of Swords. And I always like to say that, that the Ace of Swords has this energy of cutting through, right? So all the things that work on one side and all the things that don't work on the other. And if we look at this, things that work, check. Things that don't work, check. So it very much resonates. There's an alignment here. Um, there is, um, there is uh, what's it called? Like not coincidence, but like uh, when, things, when things start showing up um, in, a, in a very like way like the universe is confirming it <laughs> mercury retrograde i'm struggling here with the page of swords and the four of wands i do feel like there's going to be a lot of really good communication around what is very grounding for you what feels very homey what feels very balanced what feels very um nurturing and loving for you i think you're also getting very very clear on what home means to you what a comfortable home life means to you um, I also feel like you're getting very, very clear on what it is that you desire in your life that will bring you celebration and joy and happiness. I don't think that you're taking no for an answer and I most definitely don't feel like you are allowing toxic things to come into your life anymore. Why? Because you got that Ace of Swords in the middle and then that Five of Swords and the Five of Pentacles on the other side of it. So 
you know, I'd be lying to you if I said to you that I don't think that you may have situations like this. I think so very much. I think there may be situations with people who are spiteful, who need to win at all costs, who are very egotistical, people that will push you out, people that will make you feel isolated and cold and by yourself, um, make you feel lost, regret, etc. But what I think you're doing, given this adversity or these challenges, is you're in inaction. You're not going to fight. I think that people are like trying to egg you on. You know those people that just love to instigate a fucking fight? Like I want to punch those people in their face, you know? And I try to be like peace and love as much as possible. But those people, sometimes I'm like, man, you just deserve karma will take care of you. You know, you know, karma will take care of you. Don't ask me what's wrong with my pinky finger. I've always done this. Just doesn't, doesn't like the rest of my hand. It's like, give me away. Um, but yeah, this to me feels like you have to come from a place of peace. Yeah, you have to come from a place within, like even if the external energies are like, right? You have to remember that full moon energy, okay? Energy peak, harvest time, celebration, all right? Okay, let's get into your love reading. If you want to use crystals to support you throughout bless me sorry uh throughout this reading if you want to uh use crystals if this reading is resonating with you i would definitely stick to crystals that are connected to the throat chakra so a um, mazanite blue lace agate uh, aquamarine lapis lazuli labradorite sodalite those are all great crystals blue lace agate did i say that celestite those are all great crystals that will help you with your throat okay and speaking your truth if you want to shop over at cersei jewels and support my jewelry line and pick up modern day amulets i make crystals jewelry i design it all myself it's all made over there i would say to pick up things like priestess or high priestess because they have moonstone and labradorite and moonstone and blue lace agate there's also a 14 karat gold or sterling silver necklace pendant with um amazonite okay um so let's see uh honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together uh this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner that you seek and stay optimistic about your love life. Oops. Okay. Oops. Um, okay, what are we seeing here? Okay. You may actually get an offer from somebody that's very unexpected. Maybe somebody that you wouldn't necessarily be attracted to. Yeah, Six of Swords. The Ace of Pentacles, we're going to leave that together. And you might be like, I don't know if I, I don't know, I don't know if I want to be with this person. I don't know if I'm into this person. I don't know if that's, this is what I want. Why are your cards falling like this? You know who else? You're, it's you, right? It's your cards that have been falling like in chunks the whole time. Ace of Swords and the Nine of Wands. Yeah, like maybe some of you are fighting this person because they don't really like look like what you want or what you desire, etc. But there is this energy of like leaning in and surrendering and just being in gratitude. Um, and the Three of Swords, stay optimistic about your love life. You may even like meet somebody who you think has really good potential, but it is Mercury retrograde and Venus retrograde. So the more that you get to know them, the more you're like, oh, I don't like them at all. Like, it's almost like somebody who you thought had potential and they turn out to be a fraud. Mark. All right, Cancer, that is your mid-monthly reading. If you want to shop at Cersei Jewels or enroll in any of my courses, take a look at the description box below. Thank you so much for all your support, your likes, your comments, your shares, your subscribes. Make sure you sign up to my mailing list as well. We'll see you later, alligator. Peace out. Bye.